high in the mountains above Lake Prespa that connects North Macedonia to Greece and Albania is the 12th century Church of St. George. It's considered an important part of European cultural heritage. And that's because its fresco paintings offer a rare and interesting example of Byzantine art in the region. According to some scientists, we can see the first, uh, maybe, uh, first uh, uh, signs of uh, starting the uh, pre-Renaissance period, uh, which we can see in the expression of, uh, of the representing of the, of the saints, also in their uh, dresses. The governments of North Macedonia and Greece, alongside the European Centre for Byzantine Monuments, have agreed a deal to ensure the preservation of the frescoes. And that's the challenge facing restoration teams from both countries tasked with the tricky upkeep of these centuries-old masterpieces. The paint, as we said, comes from mainly minerals from stones and also from the vegetables or even animals, some of the uh, most rare um, uh, paints. So the, the, the paint was coming in powder, in very fine powder, and they mixed the, the, this fine powder with uh, lime in uh, water. Like they make an uh, aqueous dispersion of uh, lime. The, the painter then would apply the, the paint uh, on um, fresh mortar. Before the mortar dries, since North Macedonia and Greece signed the PESPA agreement in 2017, bilateral cooperation has gained momentum. A concrete result of that cooperation is this joint project for the preservation of the rich cultural heritage in the region of Lake PESPA, in whose water is the border between those two countries. In PESPA region, North Macedonia, for Euronews, Borja Jovanovski.